A naked man caught on camera running through downtown Fort Lauderdale allegedly high on Flaca, a synthetic drug known for causing hallucinations and violent outbursts. Like the one seen here, a man trying to break into this building because he thinks he's being chased. Uh, so the street name also is Gravel. In another case, police say Kenneth Crowder exposed himself in a Melbourne, Florida neighborhood, scaring people on the street. He's screaming and he's doing this like a bird. Just keeps doing it, keeps doing it. And he's like, I am God. An AP investigation has found Florida is ground zero for Flacca's emergence. Law enforcement is unsure why, but it's cheap, usually made in China or Pakistan, only costing about $5 for a small bag. There's uh, been a surge in it in 2015. The Broward Sheriff's Office went from zero cases in 2013 to 200 in 2014, and it's already up to 275 cases in just the first three months of this year. Labs across the state have seen a similar dramatic spike. They may not come out of it. Detective Tracy Fagone says this man was so scared after smoking Flacca, he thought he was being chased and tried to break into a barricaded Fort Lauderdale police lot. He just gets up, comes over, and he literally tries to make this and jump over the fence. But he came up short, impaling his leg, leaving him dangling for half an hour while the fire department worked to free him. I saw that video. And it was terrible. Louise Neely says she was shocked watching the effect Flacca had on her grandson, Chenard. Well, I guess he was so scared. Because all he was trying to get to safety. This is a drug you need to stay away from. It's the most important thing. And if that message from law enforcement doesn't work, what about from a grandmother? Please talk to your children. Please tell them, don't get on whatever it is. Neely's grandson is facing trespassing charges, but police say it could have been much worse. A quick high that could have lasting consequences. Joshua Plogel, the Associated Press, Miami.